guys. This is John LaFog City. It's been a while, I know. All right. Ovonic Smart Charger. Let's go ahead and review this. Let's have some fun. All right, so I'm stoked to do the review on this and check it out, actually. Um, I have a much bigger charger that I use. This one is um, a lot smaller. I've got a ton of Ovonic batteries, so I'm pretty excited to see what this is about. All right, so Ovonic has a, a non-pro version, so this is obviously the pro version, and 300 watts is the, is the difference. So you can charge, um, you know, it's a lot more power, so you charge some different size batteries, which is pretty cool. Check out the specs if you need to. That gives you everything you need. And we're gonna go ahead and crack this thing open. There is the instructions. Here's the power cord. They have a USB cable. I believe you can do firmware updates. And then they this was cool. They um, include some adapters, so that's really neat. So these look like, yeah, XT60s. That's, so that's cool. This is just a lot smaller than I've been using for the last whole bunch of years. Uh, but yeah, so that's an XT60 um, connector. And here are your balance ports. But as far as the size, I mean, it's light. It's awesome. Okay, so we'll power it up. All right, so there's no on and off switch. As soon as you put the power cord into your wall, this thing turns on. And um, as you can see, you've got Ovonic A and Ovonic B. That is, obviously you could, you know, it's two batteries, it's a two battery charger. All right, so we have the Ovonic, the car battery, 5200, 50C. So we're just gonna go ahead and use one of these adapters, which is super cool that they've got that. Okay, and we'll go ahead and go into port A. Balance port goes in. So it's reading 7.6 volts and it knows it's 3.80 to 3.81 volts per cell. Okay, go to channel A, let's enter. We wanna select the task. We wanna charge a LiPo. All right, so we've selected our parameters. Let's go down to start task. All right, so your balance port, I actually had it on this side because I'm a moron. Um, so 2S, we're over here. Okay. And we're not starting the task. Oh, we are. I didn't even hear it. As you see that it's calculating. But the cool part here is the charging, 51%, 52%. So you can kind of track how much time we've got left. So anyway, that was pretty simple. We'll come back when it's almost done and see what it, you know, what kind of noises it makes when it's uh, almost finished. All right, we're still charging. There is absolutely no noise coming off of this thing, which is sort of unusual because I'm used to the charger they've got now, basically screaming at me. As we can see, it's done. And in a few seconds here, you'll hear the little tone that will uh, I'll give you an alarm. And inside here, you could program that to be louder and you could have it on repeat like it is now, or you could turn it off. So there's more functionality within the menu. We're not gonna really go into that. Balancing, so that this charged it. So, you know, obviously you wanna balance your cells. Even though if you look here, they both look like they're balanced. If you look at the 4.20 volts, um, that's per cell on a 2S battery. But for fun, all right. So I wanna balance now. So I'm gonna go back up to select task, enter. I wanna balance, you always wanna balance. And then let's go ahead and we're gonna start the task. Looks like that these are pretty much balanced. I'm actually cool with that. It says completed 99%, but they're both at 4.20. That is what I'm going to share with you guys on this Avonic charger. Um, I dig it, small footprint. So uh, when I'm at the races or at the field, this is gonna take a lot less room in my um, tool case and on my workbenches and at the pits. So anyway, Ovonic X1 Pro, I'm giving this thing a thumbs up, real simple, um, nice footprint. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one.